I forgot who it was, but they hold it like an arcade stick. Yeah, yeah, there's people that have different grips. Yeah, it's awesome. With 64, we have really um, loose rules about controllers, and we have a culture of like people use a lot of different types of controllers. Yeah. It's not just like, you know, the original brands. Um, there's been, lately, there's been a few like decent third party controllers that have been made. So, like, people, you see people using those. Yeah, it's the, um, you, people, you see people using a lot of stuff. Yeah, and I see someone came with a GameCube controller that they can Yeah, yeah, uh, those are fairly popular. You, every yeah. tournament, you see some people with the GameCube control on adapter. Usually, there's when some you strong players that use that too. Yeah. At least, at least that I've witnessed, usually when you see people do that, they play another game. Uh, at least that's what I've yeah, seen. Yeah, although um, probably the best GameCube controller player is Quapples, who is a very strong Kirby player who only plays 64, but who uses a GameCube controller. So, it's so here um, we have Shalaka Killer. I think these are probably the first and second seeds in their pool. I believe so, actually. Shalaka, actually, uh, the, can confirm. Shalaka, the second seed for the entire tournament. Ooh. Um, and actually, the the first seed for the tournament, Stranded, was already upset in his pool. Oh man! So, you know, anything's possible here. Mm -hmm. And Killer is a very strong player. He is, yeah. At least uh, that I've seen, he he wiped most of the people in his bracket, like 2-0 too. Yeah. So he's known for these pivot up tilts. Um, there's a technique back in the day. These pivot up tilts he's doing. Um, they were like considered very difficult tech skill, but on keyboard they're very easy. Mm -hmm. So fighting someone that that would use them a lot was very challenging. He's known for the pivot up tilts. These days pivot up tilts are a bit more normal. Even people that don't play keyboard, most players can do them. But um, at least at a certain level. But uh, you know he's still like the master of it and yeah he's doing really well and uh his play style is a little unorthodox most kirby players you know will play a bit more on the platforms and the air mm -hmm. killer really just wants to sit on the ground and pivot up till you yeah that's oh, gets break. the shield break all right how's he gonna punish oh um, that's not strong way yeah yeah i think so Ooh, impressive you got that grab so what throw doesn't exist in this game i know there's a throw that doesn't exist what throw? Yeah, so there's like only what? forward throw and back throw. That's there's only forward asking. throw and back throw? Yeah. Okay. So there's no up throw, down no, throw. Up throw, down throw. Okay. But there are a couple characters, like, for example, Jigglypuff's forward throw, it looks like an up throw. It looks like a, it's like a melee up throw, right? Yeah, yeah. And Falcon's forward throw, it kind of looks like a down throw. Down throw yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm still getting used to all of this. Yeah, sure, sure. I'm, I'm coming from Ultimate, so it's just like... Yeah. It's, it's cool seeing the like the game, other games and like the other communities and stuff. Yeah, we always love to see people, you know, like part of the great thing about running 64 at, at these multi-game events is that, you know, you get people that play the other games, like stopping by, yeah. seeing what it's about, like playing some games, so. Yeah, like there's a, like a bunch of other games, like, yeah, there's there's Melee, there's uh, 64, there's Ultimate, there's Brawl Hall, and there's Slap City. Yeah, I actually wanted to play some Slap City, oh, but... I don't use GameCube. I use N64 and Slap City, and you need the special adapter the that adapter they don't have. Yeah. yeah. So Shalaka probably gonna get this edge guard. Mm. Killer being tricky, so tricky. Ooh. Wow, yeah. Shalaka yeah. perfectly times the down tilt. That I mean, is not I, easy. It looked like he was gonna live that. I don't know if that's just. It looked like what? It looked like he was gonna live it. Yeah, it looked like he was gonna survive. He spaced the up beat really well, but Shalaka had the had the perfect spacing, mm. the perfect timing on the down tilt. Down air. Ooh. It's risky to do that fast fall downer, you know, with Killer spamming these up tilts, mm -hmm. but and you get Shalaka so much found off it. Of Kirby up tilt. Yeah. Okay, back throw. throw. Killer would really like some sort of edge guard here. Mm -hmm. Shalaka just go on top platform, seeing it's not not covered. It's, it's literally just neutral right now. They're kind of just like yeah, Shalaka in no hurry here. Mm -hmm. He's he's got time. Yeah, he's at the percent where like up tilt is not really a threat to him anymore. Yeah, it's not gonna combo anything. So if Killer has to like actually play like... Uh, off the grounds, mm -hmm. and Schlock is just gonna be patient, trying to abuse Kirby's low mobility. Oh, that was a nice recovery. It was, yeah. Good recovery coming. Up. I don't know why he went for a down air there. Air. He did get the tech chase. Most Kirby players would just back air. Maybe the thought is that. If you throw out the back air, if your timing is even slightly off, then um, 
then you're gonna get a weak bear and like they might recover easily. Yeah. But the down air, you know, it's always gonna spike them. Looks like Killer is going to get back, but yep, Shalaka so just barely game, found the shield drop there. Game one for Shalaka. Yep. So where is like most of the top players from? From? Yeah. I mean everywhere. Shalaka is from Chile. Oh really? Yeah, he flew up here. That's he came, awesome. He came up for SmashCon and then he stayed Stay a couple for weeks for this. Yeah. That's sweet. Um, Killer, I believe, is from New Jersey. I, I don't. I don't. I don't know for sure. Um. I think he's he's moves. Uh, ooh, that was a great weak air. Yeah, it looks like he could have gotten more off that. Instead, he got kind of a bad position, and Killer's going to make up the percent difference. Nice pivot there to continue the combo. That's a fair. I don't Kirby know. using those jabs because they're so fast, you know? He, it's like almost any other move, it'd be too slow and Pika would hit him. Mm. He definitely didn't have the time to like turn around and up tilt or anything. Oh, I think he here. wanted S-Smash a little earlier. Yeah. Probably didn't want to like wait around there. Gets Unless it there though. He like accidentally dash back? Yeah, maybe. Okay, so, so it's situation. possible to get a Gimp off those back throws at low mm -hmm. percent, but it's very tough. Yeah, on Pika. Up he is. Yeah, Crazy. gives him so many options. Yeah. Ooh, the range on that upper. Mm -hmm. It's <laughs> it's really important when Kirby's at very low percent, like 20% or lower. A lot of Pikachu's moves aren't that effective. Like he Pikachu can't up air Kirby safely because Kirby can just tank the hit and then like do a move. Yeah. So when Kirby's at that low percent, Every free hit Pika gets is really important it's because it moves crucial, him into yeah. this percent where where Pika's moves become a lot more effective. Yeah, this not gonna kill. Barely. Forward throw wouldn't kill for another few percent. Forward throw will kill Micro. under. Yeah, it's not gonna kill. It would kill under the top platform, but not yeah. under the side. Now it should kill under the side too. Is there staling in this game? There is staling, but it does not work like in the other games. Okay. So the way staling works in this is, if you hit someone with a move, it becomes maximally stale. It's like, okay. So, okay. It's like, so Shalaka just hit Killer with a Nair, so his Nair is maximum stale. Oh, that's, that's weird. And then once, and then the Nair will go through, I believe, four stages of staleness as he hits with other moves. So like, okay. let's say he hits him with a the Nair, then he hits him with a, uh, you know, some down tilts. Yeah, so For each down tilt, the Nair will become less stale. It will become less stale. Okay. Yeah. But um, for most moves that don't deal that much damage, only like the first couple of staleness levels matter. But it's useful for combos because like, if you... Kirby trying to wall him out. Um... Yeah, so the the staleness improves combos because, like, let's say you're doing a Falcon up air chain, the first up air kind of hits him pretty far, yeah. and then all the subsequent up airs are stale up airs. I, yeah, so, so they don't hit him as high, and you can do more of them. You can combo into it, yeah. Yeah, so the okay. staling system actually improves combos, but it can sometimes hurt you, like, if you use a move as a kill move and it doesn't quite it doesn't kill. kill. Then you, they're you coming back. Yeah. You don't really want to edge guard with that move because it probably it's won't kill stale. again because mm -hmm. now it's stale. So it is important to be aware of. Killer with the lead here. But very slight. Yeah, shalaka has got to do something because Kirby can kind of just float around for a while. Yeah, you see how Killer very clearly changes his play style based on his opponent's percent. And that's something that's really important to do. He's not going to play this grounded up tilt style when his opponent is at 90% because yeah. the up tilt is not going to get him anything. Okay. Much easier to just fish for a Nair or Bear. Mm -hmm. Now he wants the up tilt. Yeah, because he's at level Ooh. 10 and he gets stuff out of it. Great. Up oh, there. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't gone. think he meant to go. I think he wanted a sweet spot, but it's very tough as Kirby. Mm -hmm. Fair up tilt. Oh, that's got to be a missed input. Yeah, I saw that. Some jabs. I don't think he wanted the rapid jab either. But still, he's got 60%, 70. 
This is kind of an awkward time for Kirby because like his Nair and Bear are not going to kill and his up tilt isn't really going to set up anything. So he wants to get Pikachu out of this percent range as soon as possible. Back here. Get him up to more like 90 or 100. Mm -hmm. So I'm assuming... Now Pika's moves are going to work. Yeah. This is scary for Kirby. He's got to play in the air, but Pikachu gets an up air. The fourth throw, Miguel. that'll do it yeah, under the top lat. So Killer case, takes game one, two. One. Yep. This would be a huge upset. I will say the one thing I love about this game, the sound design of this game is awesome. Yeah. Like for for a 64 game, it's awesome. Yeah, you really feel the hits. It goes so well with like the high hits done, you know? Yeah. Every hit feels like it, like it really matters because it does. Okay, so Shalak, or Killer is starting out on top platform now. I guess he feels like that playstyle is working against Shalaka. Yeah, I mean it was, yeah. And he probably wants stuff. a downer. This chain, ooh, ooh. oh, I think oh, Shalaka should have turned around. If he turned around, he could have done some more up airs into yeah, back air. But he still gets the uh, the edge guard. It's a quick to death coming from... Uh, yeah, uh, that's got to be demoralizing for Killer. Mm -hmm. He didn't even deal any percent. Oh, there it is. I wonder why he switched to this top platform strategy. Maybe see how he reacts to it? Yeah, maybe. I mean, it's just he won the last game playing grounded. Yeah. I'm surprised to see he did that. Nice. Now he needs this edge guard. Okay. Schlocka just keeps going high. Killer's not Killer can't ready. Isn't really punishing it's him very either. tough to edge guard uh, Pikachu in this matchup because Kirby's vertical mobility, it's his ability to go up and down yeah, is quite slow. But Pikachu, you know, can pick whether he wants to go high or low. So Kirby needs some way of like winnowing Pika's options and it's not easy. Gets the ledge cancel too. Ooh, nice bear. Down it. Up. Yeah, I can set up the up there. <laughs> he gets the fourth though. Fourth yeah, throw. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Thank you. It's the fourth though. Back oh, he instantly he goes into pivot up, up tilt, yeah. but yeah, Shalak is just out of there. So you can see Killer really wishes he hadn't taken that 40% last stock. It makes it a lot harder for him to go to stuff. Shalaka's moves are now going to be so effective. Shalaka just goes above him. I think gets right out of there. <laughs> he knows about the Kirby Nair out of shield, doesn't want to touch that. So it's Killer really just camped in top flat this match. Yeah. Maybe totally like, changed his style. Maybe he's feeling like taking a slow. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, he is up right now. So I, I wouldn't blame him kill. for taking a slow. Now he's up a stock, so he's got it. Yeah, let's see how he handles this. Goes back to top platform. He's going to go back up to the top platform, yeah. I think, I'd be, I think it'd be kind of scary to be on the top platform because speaking to up there, can kind of like... Yeah, but the thing is, well, yeah, at this percent, yeah, that is going to be... I mean, Kirby's dare is very strong. Back air, that'll see that. Okay. So let's see. Is Killer going to rush at him or just try and hold on to the space? Let's see. Yeah, okay. Back on the top platform. Just going to hold on to top lat, try and wall Shalaka out. That back air and that up tilt, very formidable at that. Okay. Double back oh, he's so low! Oh, oh wow! Shalaka <laughs> tries to steal the ledge. Oh, sweet! It doesn't work. That was, that was really, really now Shalaka is down just a full stock. And fast fall. Up this so, could be a lot so of damage. Gets the tech chase again. Yeah. Oh, this is so much damage. Oh, this is terrible for Shalaka. This switched up so quickly. Yeah. Oh, was, he went for such a big gamble there. It, was, it, it didn't pay so, off at all. It was so even. Now it's just like. Yeah, this is Ow. scary. But Shalaka, I mean. This is going to be a big combo. Oh, he could have got more up airs there, I feel like. He chose not to. Oh, you see edge guard. Killer was so yeah, close to grabbing the ledge, okay. but instead had this to up really, So really tense, scary. last stock. Both these guys have really a tough position here. I don't think... Uh, actually, yes, he is. I was going to say, I don't think Killer is going to camp top platform. Yeah, no, at this percent, you definitely want to. He, I mean, he wants a, like a bear and air. And it, it's kind of been working this game. Oh, this, this, this is big. 
This could be a big combo. And now he just needs an edge guard. Wow. Game. I think it might be. I mean, he just needs another edge guard. Yeah. Oh, wow. That Shalaka. Really good. That bear on the edge guard was crucial. Bringing it back. That was awesome. All right, I got to play.